What an absolutely gorgeous way to spend an evening. I've camped my camper up, I've stocked right up with food, drink, wine, plenty of food, telly, radio, peace, beautiful scenery. I can see this from my from my camper van. I can see this hill. And there it is, I'm walking down a country and I've never walked here before, not here. I've been up there. Last year I started exploring up there. Walking right round the ledge there. And I came back another time. And I've been up and down it. All round that. I've been right through that wood. And all over the other side. Selworthy Beacon and Trig Point. I've been everywhere. But tomorrow I'm exploring. <sighs> Not that wood. I've been through that as well. I've been through that as well. So, uh, so no, I'm going deeper into the wood. Which you can't see at the moment. Up over that way because I'm going to look for this little church one of the highest and oldest churches in Somerset right hold on a minute just put it on hold a minute right back on again you can see they're doing a bit of um, hedge tidying here and uh I don't even know where I'm going to end up yet, but I know I'll be able to get back um, in a roundabout way to where my van is. It's not far. The camper van is in the field just over there. I might even be able to see it. I'll zoom in. I'm going to see Alberta. She sticks out because she's got big aerial. Let's have a look. I can see some camper vans. It's probably further in though. Ours there might be. Yeah, might not be able to see our ones from here. Well, anyway, look at this horsey coming over. I was going to come through your field and then I thought, no, I wouldn't. That looks like a donkey. Are you a donkey? Yeah? Hello? Oh, look! Are you beautiful, baby? What's your name? Hello? Hello, darlings. Oh, hello. Hello, babies. Yeah. Hello. Aren't you beautiful? Yeah, you are. You're lovely. Yeah. Lovely, aren't you? See you again another time, then. I've got to go off now. All right. See you again. Don't you tell us? I had that on Zoom then. I had that on Zoom. Look at him open his bottom. Come on. Don't, don't. Come on. Donkey. Look at him. Look, you'll break the fence. <laughs> you got a flea flea. <laughs> I had it on Zoom with that donkey then. Oh, what I was just saying though, we're not lucky. Look. You see why I want to get away? There's so much stress in the family at the moment. Like there is in a lot of families, there's a lot of worries. This Brexit thing hasn't done anyone any favours. It's creating sort of unconscious tensions. And um, it's not good at all. Not good. Anyway, I've just found another lane up. I didn't know about this one. This is a nice round trip. See, you can do it in reverse next time, sure. I've got tonight, tomorrow big walk, although I might get back in time to come out and do a bit more. My legs are strong, very strong legs. Um, it's beautiful weather, I mean I love it like this. It's not raining, the rain's moving away. Oh yeah, I haven't had to wear a jumper. I did wear a light top earlier in the beginning. God, they're not tidying up here, aren't they? <sighs> yeah, there's a track down there somewhere that you follow after you come down from the hill there. There's a lower track that you come out and there's a um, restaurant, cafe type place up here. Uh, Bosington, is, it's called Bosington. Then I think the other one's called Allerford. I've, I've walked around a lot of pathways now. And... Uh, I'm looking forward to getting back and having my dinner. I just haven't decided what I'm going to have yet. Um, it's all tinned. Camping food, I call it. Camping food. 
Now I wonder if I can go down there. Let's have a look. Coastal path via marsh. Yeah, let's go down here. I'm not quite sure, but we'll go down here anyway. I like doing different paths. It could be that I did come down here, but when you're coming from a different direction, you don't always know where you are. I think there was another path further over that I used to, I, I've taken. Somebody else coming now. You don't want to meet the wrong person when you're coming along here. Either of these high hedges, look. Right, I'm turning off for a minute. Another small video just to end today's videoing really because I've got my, I haven't got many um, <coughs> memory cards but the thing is I have brought the laptop and I can unload on that hopefully and don't lose anything but it's not totally reliable that laptop anyway look I've come back a different way and found this little bridge tide obviously ain't coming in yet to fill up flood because apparently there's floods what a lovely scene look at this marshland isn't it beautiful you can tell the tide's coming and it's starting to swirl here, look. Six o'clock high tide, so it is starting to come in. Um, if you look over there, that's filling up more now. And some people are still risking it going out though, look. Boys on bikes. But it is filling up, it is filling up. It comes in from a big gap further up. And uh, you've got all these, like, you couldn't just run across there every uh, couple of feet. There's these ditches. But this is pretty in the spring. Warlock right? over there with um, a very unusual spire that the St. Jubercus has got. It's a beautiful church. I went in that earlier and I did a small video. And I lit some candles for my lovely family. I'd help them. I do it all the time. But since last year, things um, haven't been totally happy for a lot of them. It's a hard life, unfortunately, when things don't always go to plan. But this, what I'm doing, is free. £9 a night plus £5 if you want electric. Well, because I'm older, I'm I mean, I used to keep on the floor, you didn't have no electric or nothing, you know, I mean, you camp years ago. But now, now I, um, I have the electric, I have the telly on in the evening, watch the news. And, uh, I'll boil me kettle, you know. I think the kids, but, you know, I might have to go back to proper camping again, yeah. And if I have to, I will. I might do, I might stay on one of those premier ends. But I won't be able to get out here. There is a premier in at my end, though. There's other ways of doing things, Sheila. There's coach trips. Um, there's lots of other ways. So I'm making the most of this beautiful visit. What I'm doing now, I'm making the most of it. Even though it's a bit grey, it's supposed to be like an Indian summer by the weekend. It's supposed to be really hot. So, basically, I'm just, this is just a warm-up walk today. There's nothing just for me to do a couple of hours of warm-up. I mean, basically, I went along, across, back. I'm zigzagging. I'm finding out about the landscape. Fortunately, those clouds are very high. And uh, it's supposed to clear, and we're supposed to have lovely weather tomorrow. And definitely by um, the weekend. I avoid that. I avoid that orchard. Yeah. I avoid that. So here we are. We've got another. I'm going to go that way. Got, um, yeah, our poor lock. Footpath to poor lock. You could go that way, Sheila. Do you want to? Or do you want to go back to the way you came? Um... I don't know. I think I'll go this way. I might do that one another night. I'm going to go this way. I don't mind going back the same way. Over and out.